What's going on everybody? My name is General August and welcome to Let's Play Resistance 2! I gave in and started up a new series and I really wanted to play the next uh, the next Resistance game in line because I am a big fan of this series, um, despite what people say about the third one. Yeah, does it? Yeah, I don't know. I think about it. a lot of people don't like the third one, but I really did. But I like the series as a whole. But going in line, we will be continuing on Nathan Hale's storyline, picking up right where the first one left off. I think they show that right in the uh, the beginning cutscene. I just want to subtitles is on. I did check that. Um, however, I do want to point out uh, on the capture. Well, the capture makes it a little bit darker than what I actually see, and there are some, more often than not, dark points in the game, so it's going to be really, really dark. Uh, but not only for me, but for you guys as well. So I apologize if, uh, beforehand, I can't turn up, like, the brightness, unless there is something, an option, when we actually get into the game. Uh, but, you know, I already said it, let's get into the new game! Shit. <laughs> Um, you know, let's do it. Let's play on difficult. This game is pretty hard, though. Still playing as hail. for the sedative, but until we know how far along you are, we have to consider you a threat. I'm Major Richard Blake, Director of Advanced Tactical Ops at Serpa. Where are you taking me? Serpa Research Facility in Iceland. Survivors of Project Abraham undergo mandatory testing before entering the mainland. It's just protocol, Sergeant. Answers will come in due time. game like I said the game picks up right where it left off you know for the most part oh man Right where it left off. <laughs> like, right where it left. Yep, right where it left off. Hi. Com one, we have a Goliath approaching from the east. I can't we move. We need all available ground units on that target. That's a no go, Major. We have multiple breach points. All remaining personnel are standing guard over Daedalus. Is that a lot of weeping from outside? I don't know. Hail, take this and follow me. We have to find a way inside the base. Yeah, I got a gun. All right. A lot has changed. Um, fr well, from the first game to the second game, not only the storyline, but it has, has changed quite a bit. Uh, excuse me. Oh, that's how I jump. They changed up the controls! Uh, but they've also changed up, like, most of the mechanics as well. It looks a lot prettier. Definitely. 
There's a lot more going for it. And the Goliaths are bigger. I don't remember them being that big. We're blocked in here. We have to clear a path. You know how to use that Magnum? I know how to use a gun. All our weapons have a secondary function. A little tactical lesson we learned from the Chimera. Yep. So we get that, and then secondary. secondary fire is right beneath the trigger. Use that to detonate the rounds. And then it would be R2. So that's the Magnum's fun oh, functionality. You're gonna throw a hedgehog at me right now? Are you kidding me? Are you serious? Have to slow down that Goliath. Okay, it's like COD, I gotta remember that. They did, okay, can I pause it real quick? It's really loud in my ears. Okay. I gotta follow Blake to the detention wing. All right. <laughs> thrown, in, thrown to the wolves, man. Okay. Things are different. Um, there was a weapon in front of us. I think it was a, the Lark, which is the rocket launcher. Um, like, the controls are completely switched. You know, coming off of the first one, having not played the second one in forever. It's a little... It's a little overwhelming. Especially that I just got thrown a grenade right in the face. Holy shit. All right. Okay, okay, okay. Just needed a breather. All right. I got this at the exhaust ports. Bam. Yeah, of course it's not, like, mad at all. I, I'm waiting for you. Waiting for you. Sprinting's a little ah uh, weird. How do I crouch? Yeah. Oh, I oh I didn't mean to do that. See, everything's weird. Um, I can no longer have like a full backpack of weapons. You can only have like you can only have two weapons at a time. Um. So that's one thing. So I dropped the magnum. I think. Yeah, I've only got the bullseye and the lark. Oh, it's tap L2 to crash. Oh, that's weird. I don't like that. <laughs> because L2 is also to sprint, which is also really weird. Oh, those are our guys. Where are the Chimera? This freaking Goliath is gonna fuck us up. I think it's Metal of Honor. It's not. Is that a dude? That is a Chimera over there. Yeah, but here they come. Oh, oh my gosh, I get hit like two bullets and I'm almost dead. I should not have put it on difficult. Oh! Oh man, okay. I don't not I don't like that crouch button. No, I got like shot like twice and I'm almost dead. Ooh, this is gonna be difficult. I can already feel it's gonna be a difficult campaign. Oh jeez. Nice work, Sergeant. Let's move. I'm like almost going? out of ammo. The detention wing. Why are we going to the detention wing? I forgot. I'm still I'm still following you. Oh, there's some ammo. I kind of wish I still had my Magnum. I don't want to... There we go. Still trying to get used to the controls. Uh... Oh, jeez. They're, like, right there. They're right there, just flood down. Okay. Oh no 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 no! Wow, it's so bad. Hip fire, don't hip fire, kids. So bad. There's another one. I saw you. Hi. Thank you. <laughs> I need some ammo. Only got up to 175. 
Oh, thank you. I can pick up a lark later, actually. Right? Okay. We're good to go. Heading down to the detention wing. Oh, here's a Magnum. Oh, drones. Drones are the worst enemies in this game. I mean, they're pretty easy, but when there's like 50 of them, it's not its not a fun time. I think I can one-shot them with the, uh, the Magnum. But this is the worst part of the beginning of the game. This guy, this guy has opened the door and you just have to stand right here and be pelted by drone fire. And it doesn't help that I'm playing it on difficult where I can die in like three shots. That was like more than three shots, don't listen to me. They're shooting me, it's not the explosion. I don't think you can be hurt by the explosion. Maybe you can? I don't know. Maybe I'm dumb. Wow! I remember that part took me forever, and because, just because there were so many of them. Alright, well, shows to anyone that I haven't played this game in forever. Or I'm just really bad at games. Guys, I swear. I swear I'm okay. I'm okay. I like the magnet, though. Especially that. I thought there were more. Hello. Nice work, wow, it just one shot them. Uh, I think this is the detention room. It's like right here. This is it. We found it. Yep, that's what we're looking for. Ow! No, 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 you bitch! No, you bitch! Here we go. Fine, just do it. What are we doing? Oh, the kill switch. That's right. They want to kill this guy. I forgot about that. Not he's free. He's free. He's free. He's angry. He's angry. Alright, you're all calm now, it's alright. You calm down, Blake. Alright, so Daedalus is like the main enemy of the game. Was that that was a shiny? I forget if there I don't think there's any insults in this game, actually. I could be completely wrong. Oh hi. Do I get a flat Oh the carbine! Oh the carbine, the sweet, sweet carbine. Hello my friend. Oh the carbine is your best friend in this game. It was in the first one too, but still, it's like the most accurate thing ever. Look at that. Look at that spread. Spread. It's not even that bad hip fire. I think there's more. No? I really wish that wasn't the spread button. It's really awkward. I hate L2 is not a spread button. There's the lark. Uh, let's get rid of the bullseye. Just for now. Yeah, I got it. I got it! I got it! Like we did before. Bam! Alright. No, no, no. Give me the bullseye. Uh, you think? You know, shooting exhaust ports isn't the most friendly thing ever. Yeah, just stop moving. I... Like, you're really annoying. I'm just letting you know that. You're a bad friend. I am- I'm right behind you! 
you being shot by? Ow! The Chimera, that's why. Just keep going, just keep going. We're good, we're fine. We're fine. Golden. Airfield's on the other side of this course. That's a car line. This is Malikov. The soldiers outside the south wing have been killed. I am afraid it is likely they're dead or escaped. Copy that! We'll begin an aerial search when the evac is complete. Data, this is gone. And ready for takeoff. I know this might be a little confusing just by a plot standpoint, but I, this is the intro, of course, so. We're gonna be introduced to it. Wait for you! Oh, you're waiting for the Goliath. I think we need one more Lark shot to get the job done. What is that? Is that grenades? What is that? Oh, there are intels! Oh, you just pick them up automatically now. Forgot about that. Alright, never mind. I'm good. I thought there were more Chimera, or is it this hallway? It might be this hallway. Oh, I gotta go. That's a barrel. Yep, it exploded. <laughs> I don't have any grenades. Go away. Oh. I should use. Oh, carbine. Okay, there's the uh, the final Lark rocket. There we go. Good gun drops. One is not enough. Hmm. Why am I getting trophies? I already got like almost all the trophies for this game. Oh, it's a new system. My bad. No, I don't. I don't want this. It doesn't matter. We don't carry guns over. There's another one though! But there's another one! But there's no another Blake! Have been evacuated. We are ready for takeoff, Major. Blake, there was another one. Major! We've got hostiles! Everyone on the plane! Just go. Runway is clear. We are going for takeoff! We're good. Yay! First mission done. Malikov was just saying how lucky we are that you survived London. So, where are we headed? Serpa 3. It's a facility near San Francisco. Malikov's got to run some tests on you, and, and you'll join the others. Others? The Sentinels. People like hail. Yo, I should have a medal. Transfusion complete. Still no change on the EEG. You're certain you use the Great Seven inhibitor? Yes, Doctor. They're not binding to its cellular receptors. Give him 10 milligrams adrenaline. Once his metabolic rate is raised, the virus will multiply exponentially. He'll be dead in 19 hours, or worse, he'll end up like Shepard. We do not know that. Nothing has gone as expected with this one. He may surprise us. Now, wake him up, Doctor. Inform Sentinel Team Echo. I'll finish up here. Lieutenant Hale, you'll be pleased to know the operation was a success. Lieutenant, the Major expects us in TACCOM. Is he clear, Doctor? Yes, Sergeant. Nathan, whatever happens, you must come back for your inhibitor treatment. Do you understand? Yes, Doctor. Okay. This way, sir. Hawthorne and Capelli are fighting off a breach in B-level, but Blake wants us down in TACCOM. It's a condition black. Alright, so, they were talking about, like, we're, we're eventually gonna, like, we're still infected from the first game, obviously. Let's just, give me a sec. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do this cutscene, but I'll play it after. 
I'll, I'll talk about it. containment at B level. We just lost his visual, sir. Corporal, this is command. Do you have containment on B level? Negative command. It reached one of the lower levels, but we haven't located the source. We read you, Echo 3. Take your team up to the surface and get those batteries up. I'll send Hale to plug the leak. Com 2, get them some support and initiate lockdown. B Let's level get your gear on, Lieutenant. Hale, you're gonna move up floor by floor and clean them out. We've got enough air to last two days of Major, there's to. something outside the glass. Seal the shutters now! It's a crack Hale, find that breach! Fix the crack right! Oh man. Alright, so the Chimera are inside. By the way, so we're still infected, but we're being treated. It's obviously two years later, that's what it was said. Uh, but every th is I think everybody in Team Echo is infected and has become like a sentinel. But they get treatment. Command, be advised. We have visual confirmation of Furies in the base. We need echo ranging in all lower decks. Those are Furies. Don't go in the water. Anyway. Lieutenant, active sonar has been disabled. Recommend you stay out of the water. Yeah, that's what I said. Uh, but we, we have to get treatment like everybody's being treated for it, but yet it's inevitable that we're all going to turn. So, but they were talking about, like, hail isn't going to last because, like, the treatment is not really responding that much. So... He'll probably end up, like, just transforming anyway. Yeah, I know. I got it. I'm trying to explain, like, what people missed if they didn't get it. I'm trying to do something here! Anyway, uh, it'll end up, like, quote-unquote, Shepard, which Shepard is actually, uh, Daedalus. Shepard is Daedalus. Well, you don't know that until later, but, I mean, it's not a big spoiler. It's kind of just explained. It was like Shepard, uh, Shepard turned and became like Daedalus and was like this, really? Came like this angel figure. That's essentially what happened. I kind of made it too complicated. Um, I don't think there's anything in here besides like an intel maybe? I kind of want to grab that. Perhaps. There it is. Yay. Oh, I'm grabbing that. Um, yeah, we'll get rid of the Magnum. The Magnum one-shots, but I like the Carbine a lot better, and I, I want to keep my automatic uh, automatic weapon in the bullseye. How did he get over there? I heard Chimera. Oh, that's Makarov. Oh, no, it's not. That's uh, Capelli? Hawthorne. I'm so off. Affirmative, Hawthorne. Let's go. All right, um, we're gonna go do that, but I'm gonna end the episode here. Hope you guys are enjoying Resistance 2 so far. It's kind of, you know, like I said, picking up right where I left off and kinda throwing you into the lion's den. So, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. You can leave a like down below, your really support, especially that this is the first episode of a new series. So your support is greatly appreciated. And you can subscribe to two more videos like this from me in the future. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Ooh, boy. Stay frosty.